Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Face Off. Uh, today we're taking out the Huntress. I uh, just prestiged her. I'm trying to get better with the Huntress. Uh, and all the perks I had on her. Didn't, I didn't have a lot of levels unlocked. That's just up to 50. And all the perks I had on her were like the first perks, because I used to play Huntress a lot back when I first started playing Killer. And I uh, haven't played it for a long time. Uh, so I prestiged her. Working on getting some uh, better perks up there. Want to do some cool videos with the Huntress, hopefully. She's also a very high skill cap killer right now. And I'm trying to get a little bit more skillful with her. But uh, we're running Huntress's Law by all of these are low tier. I've gotten a lot of really bad perks so far um, during this uh, this prestige level up that I've been doing. Huntress's Law by one. Uh, every time that you get a hook, you get a token. And when you get tokens, the time between skill check warning and the sound of the skill check becomes shorter. At five tokens, there's no skill check warning at all. There's only a small regression penalty though. It might slow down the game a little bit, uh, but it's not like ruin, right Monzo? Barbecue and chili, uh, one, unfortunately, which means it's gonna be not particularly useful. I'm only gonna see people when they're really far away. I'm not very good at cross, match, ha cross map hatchets, but uh, you guys know what barbecue is. Enduring, uh, my rate of recovery from stuns is increased by 60%. Enduring is a good one for any Killer, I do swing through pallets quite a bit with her because I I don't like it when survivors just keep baiting the pallet, keep baiting the um the hatchet pull. So I swing through pallets quite a lot. This is good for that. And then sloppy butcher too. So when you hit somebody, um they they bleed more, which is good to track them. Something that huntress often has to do. And you also cause mangled status effect which makes it so it takes longer for them to heal. Wish I had something to follow up with that, like a nurse's, but I don't. And uh, we'll be pitting the Huntress today against the Cannibal. We're gonna bring in just a couple uh, pretty common add-ons here, because I don't have a whole bunch of good ones for Huntress yet. Uh, Yee Seed, hits, uh, hit targets suffer from hindered, satisfaction 15 seconds, should help me keep them in sight and hopefully get them down quickly. And um, Mana Grass Braid, uh, moderately decreased hatchet wind-up time. Uh, I like the hatchet wind-up time decrease more than anything else. It allows you to get some good throws in tight areas. Spring a little bit extra blood points for extra blood points. Let's, uh, let's get to it. Alrighty, we got ourselves a crew here. Blue Glacier, Just Say GG, Linker, and Vita. Welcome, everybody. Got some, uh, lovely, lovely little flashlight there and, uh, and, uh, Box there and a med kit there. Oh, we're, we're good to go. We're good to go. I, mean, I don't like playing against flashlights. <laughs> I don't know if there's a killer out there who does, unless they have uh, like uh, light born on, maybe. But you know, it's okay. We're gonna we're gonna make that. We're gonna try to enjoy ourselves and hopefully get some points and hopefully get some good kills for you. Let's go. Alrighty, backwater swamp. I don't I don't know if people would say that this is a good map for her. People might say that. I don't like this map as a general thing though. Um It's not the cleanest totem I've ever seen. Not the cleanest totem we've ever seen. This gen spawn over here is a weird one. I don't know what you thought you were doing there. I have no idea what you thought you were doing there. We we'll just push up over here. Gives us a chance of getting uh, something with our barbecue. Tier one barbecue is really small, right? Oh, well there goes our totem. Nothing much to be done about it. Yeah, not too surprised there. Where exactly was this now? Over here? Hello. 
Hello. Where'd your friend go? Oh, hello! Hello, Dwight boy. Hello! Him says he's gonna let us. Really, what I want though is more, uh, more of this here. We'll try to find that guy. Be happy to put some paint on him. Ran back this way. Okay. All right. There's another one down. Man, it would be nice. It would be very nice right now if I had uh, my stack still going. We're doing good. Throw that one up there where we last saw the um, the crew that just got rescued. We're gonna throw one over there as well. Towards that generator. Having uh, having three hatchets is enough to do work with, but only just. We definitely missed that one. Now that one missing was a bit silly. That one missing was a bit silly. What else you got? Let's see what else we got here. That one, yeah, I could tell. I could tell. Hey there, pal! Hey there, pal! So, this guy's got decisive. Because I definitely don't have any, um, any perks that would make it so that uh, he would otherwise show up as my target here. All right, we saw this person way Whoa. over there. We're gonna go and try to disrupt that. Of course, they came up here. Which is the default. Oh. You just did the same darn thing you just did, dude. You did the same thing twice. You did the same thing twice. I don't know why you expected different results. I'm unsure what your thought process was with that one. We just played that game. I've got quick wind up. That's gonna be tough for you. It's not been touched. So, we're gonna go back. There 
There you go. LOL! LOL! That's one dead. I mean, we want this guy. Alright, let's go. Hi, buddy! Oh, that sucks. That sucks. That does suck quite a bit right there. We played peekaboo for too long. And uh, we're paying for it now. general because I uh, I have a lot of space to make moves here oh everybody else left they've left him for his death okay I'll take a two kill when uh when I lost my my uh, nice little hunch just so early on I'll take the two kill I didn't la I didn't hook one of them at all I think just say GG I didn't hook at all Eh, it happens. It happens. I'll say GG though, for sure. I think that was a pretty good game. I had some good moves there. That guy, I mean, I should maybe chase him first instead of doing what I was doing. Like trying to bait him around the corners and stuff. But, it was, um, I was trying to get a sneaky little snipe on him. We did get a pip. I'm not very good with her yet. I know that there's people that are a lot better than her. Happy to get that odd bulb out of there though. That's always cool. And, um, Just Say GG did not say GG back. There you go. You should really, if you're gonna have your name be Just Say GG, you should follow your own recommendations, I would I would assume. You don't want to be a hypocrite now. Yeah, but that, uh, that adrenaline was a bit painful right there. We got him anyway. So, um, well played there. Let's see what the cannibal can do. Alrighty, Cannibal's going in with much the same. He's got tier 2 barbecue and chili. Doesn't do too much. I'm slightly better off with tier 2 than tier 1, of course. I get more blood points, but more importantly, my meterage is down. I can see them when they're a little bit closer. It probably won't make a big deal, but maybe a little bit of a deal. And Sloppy Butcher is tier 3 here, which means that it, basically the only difference is that they're going to be considerably increased bleeding instead of just some increased bleeding. Otherwise, Enduring 2 is still here, and Hunter's Law by 1. There are better perks I have for hill, for the cannibal here. I almost called him Hillbilly. But, uh, you know, the point of this face-off is to try to try to play them as similarly as possible with as close of a perk as possible and see how they compare and how they feel differently and how the pressure feels. So, Huntress, I know I'm not the best, but I think I had some good hits there. And uh, I'm not the best cannibal either. But cannibal feels to me like an autopilot kind of killer. I have uh, knife scratches, slightly increased chainsaw movements, slightly increases charge time, and moderately decreases chainsaw charge time. We got some extra points here. Let's go in there and let's see how I can do it. Alrighty, we're getting to go here. Getting ready to go here. I don't know. Don't expect me to, to say things that make sense. Uh, playing against uh, cats for bats. 
fallen kin, perhaps? Uh, the C word? Which I just won't say out of curio- out of, uh, not curiosity. Compassion? I know some people don't like that word. An avenging fish, 233. I can't decide who they're gonna be. We will all go down together. Got a couple, uh, toolboxes. And then some people with nothing in their hands. We'll, uh, we'll do our best. I'm not a, uh, cannibal main. I don't do basement cannibal. I do go back to the hook, though, quite often with cannibal. Depends on if I'm in a, in a, a chase I feel like I can end or not. That really tends to be the, the uh, deciding factor. We'll see. We'll see how we feel once we get in here and get into a chase or two or seven. Hopefully, I mean, we did all right last game considering that our Huntress' Lullaby really didn't last very long at all. It probably wouldn't have made a huge difference because the regression is so low. But it does give you, you know, if you get some stack... Oh, look at that. Same map. Um, not quite the same map. Not quite the same map, I suppose. We don't have to go to... We don't have to go to where... We're gonna try to bluff corners here. Yeah, you're gonna have to do that. Because otherwise I'm gonna chainsaw you, you know it too. Would have rather the chainsaw, of course. You just got rocked. Just got rocked, son. You got it decisive. Which you hit. And then we're gonna continue. That one, uh, smacked us. Right there. Alright. We're still going. I hate this map. Yeah, but this time around, honey, I've got a lot more speed than I had last time. All right. Like, definitely wasn't ideal. A lot of chasing. The decisive out of the game. But I would have much rather if the decisive was missed, you know? We're getting tapped here. I'm going right back, too. There you go. They're gonna stick around if they're smart. Why am I, why am I failing this so badly right now? Cause I was. Lol. Lol. Now I can pick you up for free! 
Yes! I wanted- I wasn't gonna pick you up while I knew I had other people around here. Hello? Basin? No Basin? Alright. I saw you, girl. Hello! Hello! Man, what a safe loop this is. Holy safety loop. What a safe loop! Man, I really want this. Where the heck does she go now? That's not so good. I lost out big time on that one. I lost out big on that one, my friends. I needed her. I needed to secure that kill. All right. This is uh this is a game over right here. I saw something that might have been a Claudette. Going back to the same damn loop. This is the longest safe loop I've ever seen. All right. Now they got the they got that, but this is a kill here. I needed it. I I needed. It. To get this girl down so I can secure a kill. I don't think it's gonna necessarily matter. We might we're gonna be lucky if we get two kills here. Alright. What a long safe loop this is. Holy crap. The safest loop I've ever seen in my life. Alright, we, we're on somebody else here. The second longest safest loop I've ever seen in my entire life. Look at this, look at this safety loop. Look how safe this is. Look how safe this loop is, holy crap, man. Nicely done, guys. Nicely done. Nicely done. Those two loops are ridiculous. I've never seen a loop that long before. I've never once seen a loop that long. Look at this, guys. Look how long the safe is. Two of them were in that map. Well, we got rocked a bit on that one, but that's okay. What are you gonna do? GG, well played. Uh, not a good map, I don't think, for him, really. And, uh, those loops were crazy. Um, who was it?
pretty good job so far.